Hi, this is Istiak. Welcome to my channel Technical Support Online. In this video, today I show you how to enable and disable your Office 365 account multi factor authentication. So, I am going to uh, browse Office 365 portal and input my email address and sign in. So uh, when I sign into my portal with my account then it says uh, to factor authentication uh, by email phone number or uh, Microsoft Authenticator apps. So I use Microsoft Authenticator apps and confirm this. After verifying Authenticator it entered the portal. Now go to the user, active user, there are two users and you can see here multi-factor authentication option so just click here and you can see here these two options are enabled so when this option is enabled you can uh, when you sign in your portal then it will be uh, verify your authentication so I am disable this option I just show you how it's working so I just disable this and um, sign out this user now I am signing again with this account so I put my email and password after I click sign in it just open automatically and enter your uh, microsoft system portal there are no need to verification so this is the option multi factor authentication disable and enable so at this time uh, this feature is disabled that's why you don't need to verify your email address phone number or email address so now i'm going to again uh, to enable this feature so click enable this feature is enabled and now click to enforce it just click and enforce for apply this for apply this feature now I'm going to the user settings click your username and click view account So on this view account you go into your account settings page and from here security info you can change here from your uh, multi-factor authentication uh, email address and phone number and the phone authentication so anytime any uh, anytime you can change your phone number uh, email address and multiple authenticator phone apps so there are three type of authenticator authenticator app email address and apps so just uh, select this option and add your phone number email address and your phone number uh, phone verification so this is the process of how to enable and disable your multiple authenticator uh, function so this is the more secure for Microsoft uh, logging issue or security security base that can uh, anyone cannot logging your user ID and password so now I am logging again and there is show the multi vector authentication phone number verification that's why I uh, enable my verification authenticator so if you like my video please subscribe my channel like share and comments on this video and stay as for the next videos thanks for watching